Good afternoon, everyone. How's everybody doing today? This is Dallas Sports 1977 coming to you here at the park in Southwood. Subject today uh, is about America's team, the Dallas Cowboys. Uh, it was a great game on Saturday. The Dallas Cowboys defeated the Philadelphia Eagles 40 to 34. Uh, they got a game tomorrow against Tennessee Titans in Tennessee. But the, the naysayers refused to accept and believe that the Dallas Cowboys has a chance or uh, opportunity to, to defeat um, the uh, Philadelphia Eagles in the playoffs or win in the playoffs. I just want to let everybody know that you see that beautiful lake out there and the water and everything is all beautiful. It is all, it's not always what it looks like or what it seems. Um, it seems pretty for the Philadelphia Eagles and everything. They Lane Johnson, one of the linemen, went down in the game. They got one of the cornerbacks, a safety, went down in the game. And uh, the Dallas Cowboys secondary has about four, maybe five different injuries. But if we can get some people back, like our middle linebacker LV, get come back, uh, we need uh, uh, our quarterback. He has played great, phenomenal during these play uh, uh, near-end season games. He played great against um, uh, he played great against uh, the Philadelphia Eagles. He played great against uh, Jacksonville. It's just that uh, he needed to cut down on his turnovers. Hopefully that Dan Quinn, the off uh, defensive coordinator, can come up with a scheme to help uh, rectify our pass rush because our pass rush has not gotten, gotten to the quarterback. And uh, most teams we've been playing, the quarterback is releasing the ball very quickly. Um, guard Minshew, I give you depth, young man. You played a great game against our Dallas Cowboys. But uh, the Eagle fans are trolling us right now and giving us all kind of uh, talk and everything and flack and everything that uh, we beat them with their backup. Well, y'all beat us with our backup. Uh, Cooper Rush was a backup. Uh, our quarterback was out before the, in that game in Philadelphia. So what comes around goes around. And I'm saying this to all of the people that, uh, that doubt the Dallas Cowboys and think that can, we, we cannot win a Super Bowl this year, you are quietly mistaken. Uh, if you don't understand the concept and the dynamics of football, you're quite, you've been deceived and confused and blinded by because you like the Philadelphia Eagles and you like other teams like the San Francisco 49ers, the Minnesota Vikings, or other teams like that that can, that can win the Super Bowl and not giving the Dallas Cowboys any kind of credit. I know it's been almost 30 years since we last won the Super Bowl, but that's okay. It takes, it takes time to build greatness. I want to give depth to... Um, um, Mike McCarthy, he has done a phenomenal job. Yes, he has. He has done a great job as our head coach. One more thing i like to say is speak to um, all the great fans in America's team all over the world. I went to the game on uh, last week against Jacksonville. It was a great game. I just didn't like the outcome. I would like to say this, too, that the Dallas Cowboys has what it takes to, to win the Super Bowl. Um, I, um, I want to speak to uh, Kellen Moore, our officer coordinator. Uh, young man, please help us in, in these times right now and start calling stuff that can help the defense out. The defensive coordinator and the offensive coordinator need to work together as one. Work together and form something great because they, they all work hand in hand. That's all I got to say. It's all about the star. Like I said, it's all about, about the star and going forward. Blessings to all the great uh, fans. Blessings to everyone. God bless everybody. Take care. Put God in your life. Love one another and go America's team, the Dallas Cowboys forever. Take care. God bless and have a wonderful, best day. Thank you. Bye-bye.